what is up you guys it's your girl that girl to show and i'm back with another video we are back with my in the hood lp series and y'all already know we in the hood when we in the projects okay y'all know it's about to be a lit video okay but before we get into all the antics that are about to go down I'm going to need y'all to hit that subscribe button. It is important that you guys do so right now because, like, why not? Like, you know, like. So, yeah, make sure you guys are hitting that subscribe button. Make sure you're hitting that like button and leave a comment down for your girl down below. All these things are free to do. They don't cost you a dime. So, just do it. Period. If you guys have been to my channel before... And if you are new here, I'm about to give you guys a quick little one two one two rundown rundown on what's going down and what's the get down, period. So, as you guys know, or maybe you guys don't know, this is Miss Jayla Easley, okay? She is, well, she was at one point the youngest daughter of Tyreek and Erica Easley, but now she is somewhere among the middle because they cannot stop having kids. Like, it's ridiculous at this point. Jayla has recently graduated high school. And her and her best friend, they always lived together in a small little apartment. Like, she wasn't really living with her parents. But she was living in the building with her parents. But, yeah, once she graduated high school, her and her best friend, they got about that building. And now they have their own little apartment. So instead of them sharing one bedroom, they have their own bedroom. This is Jayla's little bedroom. Now, they don't have much money so that I couldn't get them like a full, full, you know, nice apartment, like fully decorated. But, you know, they got what they could afford, basically. And also, I gave them little makeovers, a little one two one two, nothing, nothing too crazy. But before we get into all that, let me just give you guys the quick little apartment tour of their apartment and only their apartment honestly i'm not doing everyone else's sorry love y'all down but i'm not doing it but yeah so while i explain what's happening so jayla and tt moved into this apartment which is located in the apartment in the project building right across from their old one but yeah this is their little kitchen it is nicely decorated y'all you know, so they got everything that they basically need. They have a little kitchen area, a little tiny little bar area, you know, drink because hello, why not? Um, this is their living room. This is the bathroom, which is, you know, regular, regular. Um, we saw Jayla's room. That's right here. And then this bedroom here, it belongs to Samantha, who is TT's daughter. This is Samantha's room. Her daughter with Tyreek, y'all. Wait, hold on. I just had like a brain fart. So basically, TT's daughter is basically Jayla's little sister, low key. Y'all, it's crazy. It's, it's, we need to go to Maury, okay? And if you guys do not know, TT is the mother of two now. This is Max. Y'all, the game generated that name for him, not me. And yeah, this is TT's bedroom. It's giving grown woman, okay? That's what I'm trying to give her. She is, she needs to grow up, okay? Now, these things here were above, <laughs> y'all, I had to redo her room. Let's just say that a little bit. I had to rearrange her desk. I actually had to give her a new desk and rearrange where it was because she wanted to have a baby and we didn't have space for this child, so. But that's basically the apartment tour. And you guys, this is Titi's new little look. Y'all know, like I said, I had to give everybody a cute little makeover. Not everybody, just TT and Jayla. Let me be specific. So, you know, I'm trying to give her like a adult look. You know, like she's grown, grown. She has two kids. She can't, you know, be a little Miss Hot Mamas no more. And then I gave Chantel a little, you know, makeover too. I kind of got rid of the, the 
pink hair gave her some black hair you're a mom now she's supposed to be an elder by now this is old like and then we got our good sis brandy we've definitely seen brandy around a good amount of times y'all brandy is a stripper and she lives right here this is kayla she's been living in this apartment in this building her and her son this is her son's room over here the little spider-man bedroom and this is her baby daddy Rashad they aren't together but it's her baby daddy like and he dirty look at his face Ugh. and then this is DeAndre this is their son and that's basically it it's not too, it's too many people but it's not that much all right y'all so before I was trying to figure out what to do with Jayla TTI and TT wants to cook Jayla is still trying to figure herself out. So, for Jayla, I think I'm going to have her go to university. I'm debating. But not because I want her to go to university. Because I honestly just want her to sell drugs at the university, you know? But I figure if she's going to be on campus all the time, she might as well, you know, get a degree. So, and then her aspiration has been this academic thing for, like, mad long so, I am going to have her enroll in university. All right, finally, like, dang, they trying me, for real. But, yeah, since TT wants to, um, you know, y'all know she wants to be superstar chef on Aisha Curry. First of all, where did Jayla go? Oh, to get food. Um... I have got this new mod that I want her to use. So I need her to join the career once she's done with mommy duties. <laughs> she said, F the mommy duties. Okay, I heard you, sis. All right, this baby is loud, y'all. I cannot, like, I'm, I'm about to put this baby right in my inventory. All right, so it's the freelance chef mod. And basically, it's a new career, and it's not really active, but it's not really a rabbit hole, per se. I mean, it's a rabbit hole, y'all, but... So, as a freelance chef, you basically get to pick between two trades. So, you can be a caterer, which is, like, regular foods, or a pastry chef, which is desserts. And freelance, freelance chefs set their own hours and choose their own work. But no one really is their own boss, as long as there are clients to please and reputations to protect freelance chefs are at the mercy of their skill quality of creation and old-fashioned word of mouth luckily our freelance chefs are more than up to the task so that's what she's gonna do all right y'all so boom she's about to be a caterer because y'all already know she likes food food so freelance catering is not for the faint of heart from demanding business clients with lunches for 10 to even more demanding brides with receptions for a hundred catering cover parties catering covers parties covers party orders big and small for all types but on, put on your apron dust off your financial skills work on your communication skills and join us so yes we're gonna do that and this says welcome to the world of freelancing we're very happy to have you in our talent pool. After selecting the agency, you'll be able to use our services to find jobs posted by clients that are relevant to your interests and expertise. Some words of advice. Always be polite to clients. Finish all your tasks on time or early. Oh, and make sure you have the tools of the trade. We have high hopes for you and wish you the best of luck. So, I'm excited. So, today is Memorial Day, you guys. So, happy Memorial Day. Shouts out to us. Shouts out to y'all. It's finna be lit. Hope y'all having cookouts or live. <laughs> um, but we about to select a gig. We about to select a gig. I need a gig that's not too much, that's not too time consuming, but it's gonna give me some coin, okay? It's gonna give me some coin, but also today, you guys, we are having a cookout. We are having a little, you know, y'all already know we was finna have it. So she needs to do this early. So we can't pick something that's going to take too long. 
I'll probably do this one. My new boyfriend is coming for dinner tonight and I made the stupid mistake of saying I could cook. I have no idea why, but it's too soon for him to know the truth. Judge me later and cook me two delicious plates of something. Could you? I know this is a really I know this is really small potatoes, but I'll pay you to keep it quiet. Okay. I mean I could do that. First we need to chat with the clients. So come on, TT. Let's get to work. Put that baby down. It'll be fine. Trust me. All right. So while she chats with the client, what you eating, Jayla? Grilled fruit. Let me make sure she has enough drugs. Okay. She does not. Like, girl, how are you supposed to um sell at the cookout if you don't even have drugs like and how are you gonna sell at the school if you don't have drugs somebody has to sell drugs let's call malik over to get some drugs from him and malik it should not take you that long because you definitely live right across the street like come on malik please be nice yes buy drugs okay great um I can borrow. What does that mean, y'all? What does borrow weed mean? Because, what? Chantel, come get your bad kids. It is too many of them. Yeah, he is letting me borrow drugs. Oh, I can only borrow five. Okay. Let's, no. Let's get, yeah. That's crazy. You can literally buy. Within five days, you make my day so much better. Thanks for making me smile. <gasps> yeah, Malik always had a thing for Jayla. She should use that to her advance advantage. Like, you know I'm grown now, right? Like, <laughs> but yeah, so good. She got some weed so she could sell. And then we can pay him back. I don't remember if it's the convenience store or the basement who has shop where you can buy papers, but girl, one of them you can do it, so have fun. And then, oh. Gus is here needs to get to work, make one homestyle group dish, okay. And what I'm about to do, honestly, because I know they're going to get on my nerves. Let's... Lock the door real quick. Because I want her to cook upstairs. Like. <laughs> Alright. She gonna make some chicken alfredo. Hello. Okay. Yes. The head shop. Because we need some papers. We should probably. Grow our own at some point. So we must be get one of those. We will need at least two jars eventually. <gasps> Delivered by mail. Oh, that's ghetto. I hope it can still come today in the mail. Like Amazon type. Look at all the kids outside. Sam, what the heck are you wearing? Sam likes electronic music. Child. <laughs> they really got Rashad out here entertaining these kids. Here we go, Malik. Malik don't care who he talking to, as long as he's talking to somebody. Girl, you are not supposed to eat that. Oh my freaking gosh. Oh my gosh, she ruined it. She is so annoying. Girl, our party starts at 2, I think. Please. Y'all, now I gotta cook something else. Let's just do a pot roast. Acceptance letter? Stop. Wait, she got into some distinguished degrees? Shut up. Yeah, I think I'm gonna let her go to Bright Chester. For like communications or something like that. 
That's amazing. I am so happy for her. Even though she barely graduated, honestly. I don't know how that happened. So I was thinking about allowing Jayla to have a career as a trendsetter. Because y'all know she likes to form her own paths and do her own thing. So I think that's what we're going to do. So we'll probably do the art history thing and have her do four classes. Y'all already know this girl going floppity flop. I could see it now. And we're going to stay at home because, excuse me. And we're going to use the household funds to pay for it. We don't really care about the homework and stuff as of right now because we got a party to attend. So, yeah, I'm so proud of her. I don't know how she finessed getting into distinguished programs, but yeah. Let me go back and check on fucking TT because... Did she not cook the food? All right, yeah, girl, go do whatever you gotta do. I got to watch this. Ew, now she itching, like, come on. Yes, TT, you are locked in the house until you finish cooking these meals. Yes, sis, cook that pot roast. Come on, let's go. See, this is why you gotta watch them. Because why would you put this all the way over here? Let me see. Yes. Okay. Pack catering order. Y'all, this took way too long. Did she pack the order up? Okay. She packed it up. All right. And come on. Let's go drop off the food. Oh, she's stuck. <laughs> My bad, sis. My bad. My bad. Allow access to... CT and lock for specific sims and uh, y'all this is what happens when you try to get something to work I'm gonna just cheat it because honestly they cheated me so that was actually annoying because excuse me like why would that even happen here let's just get you all cute and cleaned up Cause you've been slaving over the stove all morning. Okay, yeah, let's go outside. Leave the baby in the house. Yes, ooh, and she put on her cute little barbecue day outfit. Her juices. She said, oh, I'm gonna be cute. I get to show off and for the first time, I'm grown. So I could drink and everything without having to hide it. Hmm. She walk in mad confidently. Oh, Bestie was wrong, y'all. It's Amaya. We about to see. Oh, she funky. Let's start our little backyard barbecue. I'm so excited. Not they matching. I didn't even try. Is that Simone? Okay, sis, you out here working out without me asking. I love to see it, y'all. I love to see it. And who is this man? Girl, you out here dating? Let me find. Ow. Oh, okay, Makai. Okay, Malik, you went home to get changed and you came right back. I felt that. Here, let's try to tap the keg. Come on, Jayla, let's tap this keg. No! Girl, that is embarrassing. Let's try it again. Let's try it one more time. Like, come on. Yes, okay, only took two tries. Not Rashad over here talking to kids. Like, I get you like kids, and you know, that's nice. But now it's getting creepy, sir. You need to come home. You really need to come home and get away from these kids, okay? Okay, Shanice, let's go. Let's do a keg stand, Shanice. Actually, I feel like Amaya needs it more. She's sad. 
Ooh, everybody coming to the block. Everybody coming to the block party. Heard you. Okay, who's this? Rain. Okay. Okay, I remember him. <laughs> Look at our little brother trying to be all cute. Like, a boy. Is he high? Oh my gosh. Tiara, you dressed yourself today too, huh? Not they got Kerwin coming to the coming to the party. That is Gus's sugar daddy though. No, I'm pretty sure that's still her sugar daddy. Let's see. I don't know. Oh no, he's not her sugar daddy no more. Oh well, sis, you could have got paid. Okay, Juwan. Juwan said, "I got this." Uh, maybe, maybe he don't. Maybe somebody else should get the ox cord. Cause what is going on? Who is Justin? That's um Jayla's little boo thing. Let's go give him a hug after you do the thing. You already know. Come on. Yes, sis. Y'all already know, it ain't a party until we doing keg stands. Y'all, everybody going upstairs. I'm about to... Not Jayla is drunk already. They over here flirting, but I need, um... Okay, yes, suggestive look. But I need you to come and cook some stuff, sis. Brandy says, you already down here. You can clean up the grill. So TT could cook later. Hello. Oh my gosh. Jayla is drunk and she's trying to. Hello. Okay, they're getting it in. And the party just started like. TZ, please change this baby diaper. Y'all, Erica said, y'all could play if y'all want, but I'm about to get down. Y'all, it's mad people out here. We is a lit. Who the heck is this? Oh, true. Okay. Who's this? Regina. Regina is on the ones and the twos. Come on, let's. Let's see what we got. Is she drunk too? Yeah, everybody is drunk already. I love to see it. Who the heck is this? Oh, Gunna. And look at our sister Deja. Oh, yes. They over here doing keg stands. It's given. Okay. Oh, okay. You do not have to drop her into a cell over there like that. That was not nice at all. All right, yeah, we need to come and speak to everybody here. Come say hi to her. Friendly introduction. Oh, it's so many kids. We need to pack them up and send them away. Oh, it's a lit. Okay. You know she lit. Y'all see the pants she got on. Yes, get it, sis, get it. She said, I see ball players. <laughs> Who is this? Tamika. All right, Iris. Iris is over here trying to, you know, get on TJ, little good side. I see you, sis. Um, hello. Are you coming to see your kid? Are you coming to see your kid? Don't worry, y'all. He's a young adult now. Even though TT got pregnant about him when he was just a teen. What are they doing in my hallway? Like, hello. Hello. What is going on? Just get out this apartment. Quincy. Miss, get your son. Kayla, sure. I don't know. Y'all, it's so much going on. Um... Be his little ass, like, for real. Okay, Brandy, I see you, sis. Oh, okay, I really see you, sis. 
Okay, Lana pulled up. Who else pulled up? Whose child is this? Arabella Givens. I don't know whose child that is. But honestly, the way that they be adopting kids left and right. All right. Let's have Rashad. Let me cheat his knees real quick. Cheat his little knees. Let's have him tend the bar. Maya is here, y'all. I miss her. Let's order drinks for the group. Let's get some Long Island iced teas. Ooh, Maya is not feeling it because Malik is probably somewhere flirting. Oh, no, he's dirty. Ew. He is flirting, though. Y'all, yeah, he's flirting. She is a married woman. Maya, does this embarrass you at all? Because it embarrassed me for you. Oh, yeah, they are done. Y'all, look at all this that they have lined up. And I did not do that. Y'all, Jayla is in love, love, okay? Let's... Y'all, they really... Everybody is getting it in. Like, can we just, like, eat some hot dogs and burgers and call it a day? Like... All right, go get some food, Jayla, because you are starved. Everybody is outside. Is he making us drinks or no? Oh, yeah, he's making us the drinks. Where y'all all going? Y'all, it's so freaking lit. Like, it's really giving the vibes. What's going on? Who died? <gasps> y'all, who freaking died? Is Malik dead? No. It's not Malik. Because... What? Wait, who am I? Who am I? You guys, I think Malik died. Shut up. <gasps> Y'all, it is Malik dying. First of all, he is dying with so much going on in his life. He peed himself. First of all, let's talk about it. And then he's burning, okay? You guys, nah, I'm going to bring him back to life because my boy did not have to go out like this. Like, it's really not his fault. Like, and let's not let people see him dirty like that. That's not like Malik. Like, y'all. But he's smoking. Like, he's really going out in style. Like, wait, we can probably plead for his death, for his life. Oh my gosh. We are about to plead. Come on, Grim. Come on, Grim. Don't be like that. Oh, wait. Wrong person. Wrong person. Wrong person. He can't plead for his own life. Grim. Why can't I plead for him? Come on, Grim. Come on, Grim. Don't be like that. Mr. Reaper, sir. Please. Please. Y'all. Yeah. Look at Maya face. She is tight. She like this motherfucker died before he made me his girl. <laughs> Y'all. They really tried to take my boy out. Y'all. He don't care. No, but seriously, why can't we plead for him? Come on, Grim. Please. Grim. Please, Grim. No, seriously? Like, why does the Grim Reaper hate me? Jayla is going to be next if she don't eat something. Y'all, it's me really trying to get the Grim Reaper's attention. Like, I got my boy just dead on the ground. Y'all, that's really Tyreek's best friend. He's going through it back there. Like, please, somebody help. That's her daddy. She just witnessed her father's death, y'all. This is crazy. Because why does this game hate me so much? Like, everyone is, like, balling for Malik. Like, 
Y'all, this is the stupidest thing. Y'all. Yeah, y'all yeah, need to leave. Because it's Memorial Day. We just want to have a good time. Jayla, did you eat something? Because... Like, what's your what's your issue? You want to be next? Yeah, I can't be bothered. We need to drink. Like, honestly. All right, you guys. So my game crashed. Um, <laughs> it was just a lot going on, y'all. A lot going on, y'all. Malik is dead. Y'all, let me know down in the comment section if I should bring him back or just have a little funeral. Like, what y'all want? Y'all want the hot boy back or we gonna have a funeral and lay him to rest? Maybe we might keep him gone so Maya can live her best life, okay? Well, we about to keep partying because y'all not the sound went out in my game. This is so stupid. All right, let's get one more drink, you guys. In honor of, of Malik, the hot boy, it's what he would have wanted, okay? He would want us to all get drunk. Not the Grim Re No, we need to talk to Grim because, excuse me, how dare you not allow us to save our friend? <sighs> uh, let me stop. Let's leave Grim alone before he kill us all, honestly. Honestly, y'all. Y'all, the homies is coming to pay their respects to Malik. They sad, y'all. They sad. Y'all, I'm sad for y'all. Um, excuse me. Why is he never making us drinks? Like, excuse me? Oh, yes. Okay, sis got a man. Y'all are so cute. Okay. I'm here for it. What's Jayla doing? Taking care of TT baby, of course. Because TT want to be drunk. Well, she can't even get freaking drunk because he not serving no drinks. Oh, Jayla Julian is here. Say what's up to your homie. Let's just ask him about his day. Let me... Rashad better be making drinks. That's all I know. Y'all, I try. Chantel is over here crying. This is so freaking ghetto. Like, why is it that I just can't have a nice regular party where no one is stupid, nobody dies? Like, come on. Why is this happening to me? And we can't even get drinks. Like, this man really won't make us drinks. Like, it's sad at this point. Like, it's really sad. Everybody's leaving. Y'all, that might be what's best. It's for everyone to leave because it is not safe here. It does not feel safe. It is not, like, it's not safe, y'all. The baby is crying. Y'all, we're going to have to worry about the baby later. And TT, come and talk to Kerwin because y'all haven't spoken in forever. Let's just talk. Y'all, we really not getting no drinks from this man. And... Ooh, a verse. A gin and tonic. Yes, let's get that. Let's drink it since he won't make anything. Like, what are you doing? Not Kerwin trying to get some boom boom shorts. He rich. It's better than sleeping with teenagers, honestly. Because I don't know what's wrong with you. Now, we not getting no drinks. I'm convinced. This baby just will not stop crying. Is it hungry? No, it's not hungry. Oh, the diaper needs to be changed. It's the fact that this isn't even uh, Jayla's issue. Like, girl, change the diaper. TC's still waiting for that drink that's never gonna come. 
Now he acting like he making it. Boy, bye. Y'all. Y'all see this man? Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Y'all, I'm... I can't play this game. <laughs> I just can't do it. Like, what is going on? They out here still trying to party. Y'all already know. When the party's over, it's some few people that just still be hanging around. All right, y'all. I'm going to end this episode right here because Memorial Day was a flop. Like, oh my gosh. Like, why would Malik die on us like that? Like, he really, he really ruined the vibe of the party. Like, y'all, he really ruined the vibe of the party. Like, why would he do that to us? Like, that was, that was so selfish of him to die. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have an amazing Memorial Day. Um, you know, get drunk. Get drunk like my Sims couldn't because that man ain't want to make us our drinks. Okay? And yes, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.